How you doing guys? I'm Sean. Welcome to Rambles with my camera. Guys, today's ramble, today's video is something completely different. And, uh, well, it speaks for itself. You're probably wondering why I'm putting this here on rather than some street photography. It's a different type of street photography. This is street, what do we call it, cinematography. And this is the set of my home here in Waterford in Ireland. And it's the 29th of August 2016. And what we're watching is the Flying Ant Day. It's uh, the nuptial flight of ants. I'm not too sure if you're familiar with it. I'm going to just share a wee bit of the thing. I, I became fascinated with this when I first observed it about three years ago when we moved into here. And basically what we're witnessing is, is that the ants are with the wings on them. They're actually queens. And you see they're much larger, obviously, than the wee small ones without the wings. They're actually working, working ants, yeah. And the wee smaller ants, or not the smaller ants, the smaller ants and the queens with wings are the male ones. Now there's one getting dragged about there. And basically what's going to be happening there is, is that see, they all fly off on this one day and it corresponds with other colonies um, throughout, you know, the garden and things like that. And what will happen is, is actually the queen will be mating with the male ants from the other colonies so that there's no inbreeding going on and basically um, as soon as the male and they see there to be male one coming out now and i'm not too sure you know are they all going to be going off at this day here or what but there's certainly a lot of activity you can see the one getting dragged back in it's just at around about six o'clock at the bottom of the screen there and it's getting pulled back in so i don't know whether it's like um, the workers are pulling it back in again maybe it's the wrong day they're saying get back in hold on to your mojo brother because the biggest thing that happens, well not the biggest thing, as soon as it actually um, has sex with the, the queen, and then actually they're flying when they do this, yeah, they do it in mid-air so they don't do it on the ground, like, basically when they're flying, and they actually have sex with the queen, the male ant, it dies, it, it, it instantly dies, um, its innards can explode actually, so you could just, you think we're lucky we've been born in this reality as men so no more moaning and groaning men but basically this is what it's all about um and i just think it's fascinating because they have no idea there i'm shooting the nikon d3300 uh on this here so just give you a bit of an idea of the the camera itself um this is a different angle a uh, different angle different part of the garden and you just see the ant flying off there um this one here is shot with the um kodak play sport just give you a bit of an angle of the, the all them immersion they're two different colonies you see and what they're going to be doing obviously they're going to be mating with each other and the, the whole thing about the queen as soon as she becomes fertile she will retain um the sperm the semen of the, the ants that she mates with in flight for the rest of her life it could be for 20 years and what she'll be doing is she'll be self-fertilizing and laying eggs constantly from that now I don't know about how you feel about ants to me they're no real bother at the end of the day they're getting on with their life and getting on with mine and i just wanted to uh, show you i think it's just it puts things in perspective because they have no idea that we're there or i'm there or we're watching it on youtube and they think that they're top of the tree and then of course us humans we think we're on top of the tree but in reality i wonder who is actually out of our range of few is looking at us and observing us now and maybe it's uh makes you think doesn't it so you go guys listen sending you love from ireland a wee bit of a different video and i just wanted to uh share that with you and next time you see any big ants and things like that they're queens and they're doing what nature does and uh aren't we all just going to try to coexist and get along and uh, hopefully um none of our innards explode the next time we're uh, making love with a beautiful lady um there you go 